you can reposition the spindle and using this set screw so you can access higher clearances depending on the end mills you use okay now we use the 13 wrench, wrench on the top on the spindle we tighten up this knot here and using the 17 doesn't have to be too tight just a snug right there after we change the tool on the screen now we click continue and the Z retracts to zero after the tool is installed you can go to DRO here and you can see the tool length offset in Z here in our case is 1844 uh, this, this comes from your tool tables 